I would like to begin today's session with a famous quote The world is a book and those who do not travel read only one page of it Most of us love to travel right and if traveling was free of cost we all would love to read every single page of the world book It is not only us but a large number of wonderful creatures in the animal kingdom who travel thousands of miles every year and we often call them migrators we have many interesting questions that pop up in our minds when we listen to the term migration what actually is migration why do animals migrate and how do they know the exact time to leave and to reach back to a particular place also how do animals know the exact route maps when we here struggle with our google maps let us try to answer all these questions in today's session to begin with let us see what migration is migration may be defined as the long distance movement of large number of individuals of a species usually on a seasonal basis like the flock of siberian cranes who used to visit india during winters the saddest part is that we don't see them in our country from the past few years due to some tragic environmental factors there are large number of interesting organisms that migrate ranging from mammals fishes and birds to reptiles and even insects now the question is why do they migrate and the answer is quite simple we live in a world that keeps changing the resources keep fluctuating and the animals tend to migrate into better living conditions the basic reasons are food shelter breeding or reproduction and surviving the harsh climatic conditions take for example the humpback whales they are massive creatures that travel around 5000 miles every year they usually feed during summer in nutrient rich waters and then later migrate to warmer tropical seas during winter to breed and give birth to young ones birds usually migrate to move from areas of low or decreasing resources to areas of increasing resources the two primary resources being sought are food and nesting locations of all the organisms that migrate the bird arctic tern travels the farthest it has longest annual migration record of 50700 miles that is about 81600 kilometers imagine if we add it up for the lifetime of the bird its journey is equivalent to three trips to moon and back that's really amazing monarch butterflies are the most beautiful insects that are known to migrate as far as about 3000 miles to reach their winter home if we look into the migration in fishes the pacific salmon is an interesting species which hatch out and live the first part of their lives in fresh water and then later migrate into the ocean to spend their adult lives now it's time for us to answer the rest of our questions how do animals know the exact time to leave and to get back to a particular place and what route maps do they use to navigate fascinating researches are being done in this topic they say that animals use the sun and the stars their sense of smell their natural instincts and the earth's magnetic field to decide the time 
as well as routes of the journey. A recent research describes that the Pacific salmon fish senses the changes in intensity and angle of Earth's magnetic field to establish their position in the ocean. Amazing, isn't it? Whether it's on the land, in the sky or in the sea, animals travel all over the world despite the challenges they face throughout the journey. Hats off to them and thanks to all of you for listening.